Hi guys, Demi Newton again, uh, coming to you with part two of the um, uh, Narin's Hellboy um, paint up work in progress I'm doing. Okay, so let's see where I'm up to. Switch this. Oh, high budget videos, you gotta love it. Okay, so what I've done so far magnets into the feet. Um, so drilled them out um, and then just put a mixture of super glue and baby powder into um, uh, seal them in there uh, magnet in here and another one in here uh, I'll show you that in action so again another magnet on there you can see uh, the mixture of baby powder and super glue gives you like a a sealer, you know. Uh, so just put that on there like that, and uh, again one on the knife. Uh, sanded that down as well, nice and smooth. Uh, just sits there like that. Uh, all the other pieces uh, are pinned. Uh, this one is a one millimeter pin because uh, it's a bit out of focus. The uh, triangle there was quite small and I didn't want to go and shatter it. Uh, so just a one mil pin in those. Uh, on the, um, uh, what would you call these, the pouches that sit on Hellboy, uh, that's got a two mil pin in. Um, try and do this one-handed. So uh, drilled all those holes out as well for those to sit in. Um, so, this has been primed, uh, just, whoops, Jesus, just a black primer on there, uh, base down there, again, uh, uh, slightly black because I've primed it in, in situ, um, so two magnets in the base there, um, sanded those nice and smooth also, um, so again filled it in with a super glue and um, baby powder, talcum powder rather, uh, mixture. Uh, sealed them in and then just a little bit of filler uh, on top where I've kind of um, scratched it, uh, sanding it down. So uh, lovely and smooth. Uh, I'll tell you what, let's move all this stuff off and then we can put them on, on the base. stands on the base like that. Um, put his knife. Put his knife on there. Are you joking? I keep waving my camera everywhere. I'm sorry. I must be getting dizzy. Um, where's his gun gone? Uh, gas grenade I've pinned here. So it sits nicely there. Uh, held by himself. Um, so, standing on my leg. Um, uh, drilled rods in uh, and used epoxy resin. Uh, to seal that up. Um, I think it's, it might be four mil brass rods in there, in here, and um, I pinned his head on also and scuffed up the underneath so the uh, resin uh, epoxy had something better to stick to. Uh, this is uh, what's called green stuff from um, Games Workshop. So uh, put it all on, sanded it right down, lovely and smooth. Obviously once I put some um, um, oh, what am I talking about? Put some primer on there. Um, I'll see where the errors are and go in and, and fix those. Uh, so let's stand him on there. Oh, tendency to swing on that. I'll have to fix that. Uh, and then uh, the horns here keyed in as. Uh, how it should go. So again, drilled a hole in into his head uh, for the key. It's 
just to better support these horns on there. I need to get a better setup for this camera. I cannot keep doing this one handed. Right, that's that. So that's how he's looking at the moment. Pretty cool. Um, there's obviously stuff I've still got to do. I need to make sure that this is nice and and sanded smooth. Not sure if it's showing. It might be. Uh, there's a slight indentation here where we drilled it. Um, this hand here, God, I had some issues. Um, let me just uh, take his horns out so I can show you what I'm talking about. So, very fragile drilling down into there. You can see where it broke. It snapped all along there. So I need to fill that in, sort it out. Uh, again, it's got the glue thing. Quite a few magnets packed on top of each other there. However, give me a massive issue. Uh, let me show you. So this swap out hand again, uh, drilled out a couple of magnets. I think there's two maybe magnets in there. Uh, on it goes like that. However, the other hand needs rethinking. Stupidly, I didn't think about the weight of the gun, so it's a fair old gun that with some weight to it. And you can see it is quite magnetized, it snaps into place, but it's too heavy. There we go. Um, so I need to think about how, how I'd fix that, you know. I am only paying it for me, it's not for uh, anybody else, a client or anything like that. So I may just glue this hand in, because why would you not want this hand? This has got, I can't remember the name of his gun now, this has got his gun on there. Uh, it's a fantastic looking hand, loads of detail on that gun, can really go to town on that. Uh, make it look really visually interesting, much better than that, which is just a hand. Now, there's loads of detail on the glove, but there's loads of detail on the the, the gun hand glove as well. Um, so, all I need to do now is get the primer on here. Um, and I bought one from a local um, DIY store, and this is kind of a burnt red. Uh, so I thought it might make a nice base for me to build up on. I'll then pick out the highlights in white using the airbrush and then go over with a, a you know, a nice red for, it, for him in the end. But uh, that's where I'm at. Still loads to do. Um, but, you know, I'm glad there's still loads to do because it's an expensive kit and, you know, you want to get plenty of, uh, uh, put plenty of hours into it to entertain yourself. So beautiful kit. Um, you know, putting loads of work into it, loads of sanding this morning, trying to get my um, all my seals clean. Uh, of using the green stuff, or um, that's what it's called, green stuff from Games Workshop. Uh, you could use Milliport or Aves, something like that, but uh, that's what I had in, so that's what I've used. So just went to town, sanding, 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 using really fine paper, and there's no. There's no kind of, you can't feel it when you scratch your thumb now, it just feels smooth. Uh, but obviously any bits that I've missed will show up once I primer it. And then I'll probably have to sand all that down as well. Um, slight blemish around here I had to sand out. And I think, looking at his goatee, there might be something just up here that I need to take care of as well. But I'll have a look at that once the primer's on. Um, so, standing tall, looking good. Um, I'll, um, sorry I've not posted in a while, I've been a bit busy with work and things, but um, you know, I've got four days off now, so I'm hoping to get some decent work done on this. So there we go, again, I'm Damien Newton, thanks for watching, take care, bye bye.